Did y'all see Vice President Kamala Harris and her running mate, Tim Walls, trolling Fox News? <laughs> I loved it. So the other day, Fox News had to bring back the big guns, Elizabeth Hasselbeck. Y'all remember Elizabeth Hasselbeck? She was on The View for years. I think she was the lone Republican voice on The View, and there were regular regular battles going back and forth between the ladies on The View and Elizabeth Hasselbeck. I think um, Rosie and, and Elizabeth used to go back and forth all the time. Well, like Meghan McCain, Elizabeth got tired of it and she left The View. What's she been doing since then? Anywho, she was on Fox News the other day. They brought her on to talk trash about Kamala Harris. Here's what Elizabeth Hasselbeck had to say. Well, you just talked about Kamala Harris supposedly eating a bag of Dor Doritos so emotionally charged after hearing this. That's the commander in chief, potentially. That's the emotional response of the leader of the free world is to binge eat a bag of Doritos? Are you kidding me? Can you imagine Putin, how he deals with things, chugging down a bag of Sour Patch Kids because he's depressed about something not going his way or back of the day, Soleimani, what is he binging on Funyuns? I doubt it. I doubt that's the actual response of an elite leader, whether you agree with what they're leading or not. Now, for those of you who aren't always tuned in to politics like I am, y'all are probably like, what the F is she talking about? Here's what's going on. Madam Vice President sent out a fundraising email the other day. And in that email, she was reminiscing about how she felt and what she did the night that Donald Trump won the presidency. She talked about how on that night, she um, had to take the stage to represent the state of California because she had won her Senate race, right? And she said all she said was, quote, we will fight. In her fundraising um, email, however, she goes on to say, quote, then I went home after she did her acceptance. Um, she went home. She sat on the couch with a family-sized bag of nacho Doritos. She didn't want to share not one chip with anybody. She didn't want to share a chip with her husband because she was in shock that Donald Trump had just won the presidency. She goes on to say, quote, things are true eight years later. I still love Doritos and we still have not stopped fighting, end quote. And so, you know, Republicans have been trying to grab hold of something that will stick so that they can use it against Kamala Harris and Tim Walls. This won't work either. Them trying to use the fact that she ate a whole bag of Doritos, baby, because that night when Donald Trump won, I had me a big ass mug like this full of sweet red wine. I woke up with a, with a hangover the next day, okay? So, yeah, all of us were, were in our emotions that night. And so, Elizabeth goes on to Fox News. She said what she said. And this, this is what Tim Walls and, <laughs> and Madam Vice President are doing. They are now on a bus tour um, for the campaign. So, they stopped into a convenience-type store. This is what they doing. Tim Walls is like, I got you, Madam VP. Tim Walls is like, Madam VP, it ain't go right here. <laughs> Let me tell you why I like um, Tim Walls. I like Tim Walls because... I love the policies. I love what he has put in place for his state, right? But what I love about him coming onto this ticket is that one, first and foremost, he is protective of VP Harris. Okay, that's number one. Number two, he is supportive of VP Harris. He is not trying to step in front of her. He is not trying to overshadow her. He moved right into place 
to be a support system for her. Number three, the man knows how to get under Donald Trump's skin. He has been trolling Donald Trump and them, <laughs> and them crowd sizes since they've been out on the trail. He's smart. He's intelligent. And um, yeah, he, he is. He is the right one for the job. Did y'all hear? Did J.D. Vance accept the, the VP debates? Any, I ain't heard nothing about J.D. Vance accepting the VP debates. Or I heard J.D. Vance wants to pull out of the v, the VP debates. Y'all let me know. Y'all let me know. Um, but yeah, they trolling. <laughs> they trolling. Hey everyone, I wanted to personally come in and thank you for tuning into my video. If you've come across this video and are not subscribed to the channel, go ahead and click that subscribe button. I would be happy to have you. We talk all things politics over here and we have a good time doing it. Thanks again and I'll see you in the next one.